do want to ask you guys, how do you feel your music has evolved since 2019? Ooh, good right? question. Like, who are you now compared to then? You want to take this one, Pierce? Sure, I'll go first. Um, I think I trust myself a lot more with just the overall process. So I feel more confident in in knowing that it will come, that the next line will come, the next chord will come. And just sitting and putting all distractions aside, ideally first thing in the morning with a cup of coffee and just whatever the assignment is that day, whether I'm doing a beat or writing or like mixing for someone, it's just sitting there and just and just trusting. And sometimes, and I've been really ge geeking out on uh, Rick Rubin's book. Like he <laughs> covers a lot of this. It's so good for the creative act. Mm -hmm. And it's just, um, I don't I don't know what it is. If you call it like the universe or you call it um, your muse or whatever, just mm -hmm. th words that are not your own, mm -hmm. just come in and sure. that, whoa, that's the line. Like, and don't question it. Just, okay, that's the line, go. And I've been trying to, to the extent of don't even get out of the seat until this verse is done. Like that's, so I, I, I would say just the, the, the confidence in, in the process. Nice. That means you locked in. That was inspiring. That, that very inspiring. Um, it was words inspired. <laughs> Those yeah. words, it was an inspired word mm -hmm. that we're well, going to express that we're gonna on April 11th. That yeah. doing April 11th. Yeah. Yeah. Inspired word, Brooklyn Music Kitchen.